No matter what, but it could get a little sticky. It's going to get really, really hot. And that's why we sent our Jennifer Hoff out amongst the people and the fairgrounds to find out how do you stay cool when the temperatures get so high. At the state fair, it's fair to assume the weather will be warm, but for fair goers like Elaine Heisterkamp, yes, it could be record setting this year. You can see that I'm already sweating. <laughs> we may not stay that long. Care 11 meteorologists are forecasting triple digits this weekend for some parts of the state. And if that happens, it would be the first time this year. Already, there have been 27 days in the 90s. Our record day for heat here at the Minnesota State Fair was actually all the way in 1931, where it reached a total of 105 degrees. So that is the year that holds the record. The fair spokesperson saying there are eight misting stations and two buildings with air conditioning, along with free water stations, if that's your thing. This is how we hydrate. What is it? the liney slushy at the uh, bar there? And it's delicious. Kelly Teakip also came here early, trying to beat the heat, the tree canopy, creating coveted shady spots. But for those that can't avoid it, like the animals, there are fans and frozen flooring tiles. It feels perfect right now, but the next two days look kind of dreadful. Okay, to be serious for a minute, because, you know, the fair can be a lot of fun, there are two first aid stations that are on the grounds, and then they also have a dedicated 911 dispatch center. So if people do need no. mm -hmm. medical attention, that is here. But I just go and get the beer, usually, if I'm it feeling helps. that it beer helps. in the story. I had to it wait helps. until I'm done with this story, so I'm going to go get that. Yeah, why don't you go do that? You've earned it today, Jennifer. <laughs> it's thank a hot you. one, though, in all seriousness. It is so. a hot one. People yeah. do need to be careful with it. Right. Jennifer, thank you. Yeah.